44% of people watch five or more videos online every day, and a staggering 64% of consumers reported that seeing a video makes them more likely to buy. And to top it off, there are four times more buyers who prefer to watch a video about a product than those that prefer to just read about it. All this means that if you want to grow your business and make more money, you have got to get into the video marketing game. If you're new to the channel and want to learn how to make more money, make sure you subscribe and click the bell. That way you never miss a video. Before you start making videos to grow your business, it's important to understand the different types of videos you can use. Here are 13 types of videos for marketing. Number one, explainer videos. As the name suggests, these types of videos explain how your product functions and they show how your target customer can benefit from your product. Number two, brand videos. Brand videos are usually part of a larger ad campaign. These videos are basically ads placed on social media and they are typically created to increase traffic and boost brand awareness. The purpose of these videos is to share the brand's mission, culture, personality, and products and services. Number three, event videos. If your business ever holds events like a conference or a networking event, then you could create a video to document the experience and showcase the event highlights. Number four, disappearing videos. Disappearing videos, like those you'll find in Snapchat, Facebook stories, and Instagram stories, can add a sense of urgency, making your followers more likely to watch them. Number five, live videos. Showing up live to your social media audience will help you connect with your target market in real time. These kinds of videos can be a great way to promote events and products. They can also attract higher engagement rates. Number six, demo videos. A demo video shows off your product. These kinds of videos dive deep into what your product is all about. In this kind of video, all of your product's key features are shown and viewers are encouraged to make a purchase. Number seven, educational or how-to videos. These kinds of videos are very popular. These videos will teach your potential customers something they want to learn more about. Videos like this can help you build a long lasting relationship with future buyers. Number eight, personalized messages. You can even use videos to deal with customer service requests or questions from future customers. Not only does this leave more of an impact than your typical email response, but it can also build trust. Number nine, expert interviews. When you interview an expert in your field, you can provide a lot of value to your audience. This is also a wonderful way to position your brand and business as an authority figure in your industry. Number 10, animated videos. If your business deals with abstract or hard to explain topics, then animated videos could be a great choice for your business. These kinds of videos have room for a lot of creativity and they are very attention grabbing and entertaining. Number 11, case study and customer testimonial videos. If you want to increase your business's social proof and build trust with your audience, Testimonial videos are a great way to do it. These kinds of videos really help to show why your product is the best out there. Number 12, augmented reality, also known as AR videos. Videos or images where a digital layer is added to whatever you're viewing is referred to as augmented reality. This style of video is still in its early development stages, but it has a lot of potential. Number 13, virtual reality, also known as VR and 360 videos. These types of videos have been growing in popularity for some time. People can watch virtual reality videos through devices like Oculus Rift. They can also watch videos like this by using a mouse or a finger to scroll around the screen on their device. These kinds of videos are still pretty new, but they have a lot of possibility in the world of video marketing. How to start video marketing. Now that you have an idea of all the different kinds of videos you can use to grow your business, I'll walk you through the exact steps to begin video marketing. Step number one, know your target audience. 
you must first understand who you're making the video for before you can produce an effective video. You have to know exactly who your target audience is. Once you know who your target audience is, then you can create a video with the format, messaging, and content that will really resonate with them. Step number two, identify your goal. What is the purpose of your video? Maybe you want to increase brand awareness or boost sales, or maybe you would like for more people to join your email list. No matter what your goal is, you need to know what objective you're trying to accomplish. Once you know your goal, you can design every aspect of your video to reach this goal. Step number three, plan your budget. As with anything else in business, you need to know your budget for your video marketing campaign. Will you be able to afford a professional video editor? Do you have the right equipment? Will you have to rent a studio? Or do you plan to use your smartphone? Will there be travel costs? And then let's not forget about advertising costs for the video. The main thing is you want to know how much money and what resources you have available to you so that way you can make the best video possible within your means. Step number four, select the best video format and come up with a video idea. This is the creative and fun part. You get to choose what kind of video you want to make. You can use the list of different types of videos that we discussed previously to help you make the choice. Let's take a look at an example. Let's pretend your goal is to drive traffic to your website for a 24-hour flash sale. Well, in this case, disappearing videos in the form of Facebook stories or Instagram stories would be a perfect fit for you. They will add urgency to your ad campaign and make viewers want to click on your link and go buy your product. It's also important to keep in mind that scripting your videos can be very helpful. This ensures that you say everything you want to say in a clear and concise way. Even just writing bullet points can be a great way to make sure that you are conveying the right message. Step number five, select a platform to publish your video. You need to have an idea of where you want to post your video so you can tailor the video accordingly. For instance, Instagram videos can't be any longer than 60 seconds. Here are the main platforms you should consider posting your video on. YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Vimeo, your website, and Snapchat stories. Remember to look back at your goals for video marketing and also remember your target audience. This will help you determine which platform is best. Sometimes it might be best to just focus on one platform for now, and you can always expand and repurpose your videos for other platforms at a later time. Step number six, recognize and overcome creative challenges. You want to be prepared for any possible problems that may arise during the video production process. Here's what I mean. Let's say you've never edited a video in your life, and you don't have the budget yet to hire someone to edit the videos for you. Well, in this case, it's probably best to stick to one or two camera angles and focus on jump cuts to keep the video engaging. You don't want to bite off more than you can chew. Know your strengths and weaknesses and adjust accordingly. Step number seven, decide how you will measure your video's success. There's no way you can objectively measure the effectiveness of your video without first determining an effective method for tracking its success. You won't know if your video marketing campaign is working if you have no way of measuring it. Refer back to your goals. If your goal is to increase brand awareness, then focusing on views, likes, and shares are a great way to get an accurate measurement of how well your video is performing. However, keep in mind there are a ton of different metrics you can use to determine your video's success. You can see how much of your video the average person watches and exactly where they lose interest and stop watching. Step number eight, make the video. Now is the time you've all been waiting for, making the video. If you decided you're going to record using your smartphone, try using a selfie stick or a tripod to avoid having shaky video footage. You'll also want to remember best practices for lighting. Keep your lighting setup simple. For example, you can try using three-point lighting. Take a look at the picture on the screen. You'll notice three elements. The first element you'll see is key light. This is the main source of light. The second source of light is called the backlight. 
This gives depth and separates the subject from the background. And lastly, you'll notice the fill light. This gets rid of the shadows. The main thing is that you avoid harsh shadows and stick to plenty of soft, natural light. Step number nine, edit the video. There are a lot of free video editing softwares like Movie Creator for Windows or iMovie for Mac. These are great options that you can use to edit your video. Even if you don't have a computer, you can find plenty of free mobile video editing apps on your smartphone. Look through your footage and find the absolute best clips to use in your video. It may be hard to do sometimes, but remember, if the clip isn't necessary for the story or doesn't have a purpose for the video as a whole, you have to cut it. Step number 10. Publish your video and use SEO best practices. You are basically getting free exposure when you optimize your hashtags, keywords, title, and video description. So always use SEO best practices when publishing your video. Make sure your video has relevant hashtags, a catchy title, and an accurate description with more keywords. After that, you can publish your video during your preferred platform's most optimal posting times. Before I move on to step number 11, please give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, and click the bell. That way, you'll be the first to see my next money-making video. Also, type the word yes down in the comments below if you are going to start using video marketing to grow your business today. Step number 11, promote the video. And last but not least, promote your video across all of your social media channels. You can even boost your video's engagement by replying to comments and encouraging viewers to share and like your video. If you want to learn more about marketing and using social media to grow your business, click the video on the screen. Here I'll tell you everything you need to know about social media marketing to grow your business and make more money.